the best physiques have shit going on behind the scenes that you are not aware of. Perhaps this is something that is not often talked about. And this creator has an autoimmune disease that has impacted the way that he looks and his body. And I have a very similar experience. So I wanted to share my story. I have dealt with gut issues my entire adult life. I was diagnosed with IBS in my early 20s, but I didn't really believe that diagnosis and I continued to look for answers. And while my health continued to decline, I ended up getting a plethora of autoimmune disease diagnoses. This includes lupus, Sjogren's, vasculitis, and uh, other chronic pain conditions like peripheral neuropathy, a headache condition, and SIBO, which is a gut condition. In my early 20s, while I was dealing with all of these gut issues, I had massive, massive food anxiety. I got sick just about every single time that I ate. I was either over the toilet puking or over the toilet on the other end. I was terrified to eat anything. And as a result, I had a very slim physique. I was told over and over, oh my God, you look so good. Oh my God, you look so great. Oh my God, you're not eating because you're sick? Man, I wish I had the same condition as you so that I could be as skinny as you. All these kinds of words are like well-intentioned. They're not helpful for somebody that is struggling to get the type of nutrition that they need. Fast forward to now, 15 years later, I am still dealing with gut issues in the form of SIBO, small intestinal bacterial overgrowth, where I still get sick just about every single time that I eat. I have lost a lot of weight, weight that I wasn't trying to lose. And for a while, I was okay with losing weight because I had gained weight when I was on prednisone for two and a half years. But now I'm back to my pre-prednisone weight and I am now continuing to lose weight. I am monitoring my condition with my doctors and watching my weight and nutrition the best that I can. I want to reiterate what this creator said. It, just because somebody looks great doesn't mean they don't have a dumpster fire of shit going on in the background that you don't know about.